New this morning, a Dayton bar and restaurant is offering more dollars an hour to attract and keep employees during a nationwide staffing shortage. And 2 News reporter Adam Reif explains how these pandemic bonuses could help them solve the staffing issue. Lot 27 Brewing anticipates a busy summer and they're ready to serve, but they need enough staff to do it right. And this program could help. We're really, really busy right now on Thursday, Friday and Saturday. And it's it's just it's a madhouse. Colin Barnhart says the biggest struggle at Lock 27 Brewing is not attracting business. It's attracting staff to keep up with the rush to try to bring in new people. They're offering a four dollar an hour pandemic bonus for current and future kitchen staff. Thankfully, after the year that it's been, we've really started to see business come back, which has allowed us kind of to be a bit more free with with how we can give back to our employees who've stuck with us. The program will run through October. Barnhart says it's a thank you to the people who stuck with with them through difficult times. Colin says other Miami Valley bars and restaurants are also working on creative ways to boost staffing. You're seeing it everywhere. Different places having to close early to having, you know, less menu items, stuff like that, just because staffing is so tough right now. Barnhart says the restaurant is ready for a fun, different summer this year with the return of Dragons baseball, a new patio, live music and trivia. I think that everybody realizes what kind of struggles we went through, what we're still going through, getting back on our feet. And for the most part, people are, are very understanding. He thinks it'll still take a while for the industry to get back to normal, but they want to be ready as soon as possible. We're ready for the noise, the traffic, you know, all of that kind of stuff. It's just good to see Dayton grow again. Lock 27 Brewing says the open kitchen positions pay between $10 and $18 an hour, and that's before the bonuses kick in. People can apply in person or online. In Dayton, Adam Rive, 2 News Today, working for you.